Full Moon Dudes, welcome to the vidcast of Wednesday, the 15th of January, 2014. I've been told to make these vidcasts a little shorter, so I'm gonna to try to like just zip through what's important just this week, because if I talk about future stuff, we'll be here for a frickin' hours. So most importantly, we have just launched and announced the first three movies that are gonna premiere on Wizard Studios at Full Moon Streaming, our awesome streaming site, next month. As you probably know, we've opened the doors under this new label to uh, bring in and help independent filmmakers who don't really have a home for their movies today, a little tricky because of the way the world works. And as these movies are submitted, we are obviously choosing the ones that we think are pretty damn awesome. And uh, starting on Valentine's Day next month, and every week thereafter, if everything works out well, we're gonna premiere a new movie on the Wizard Studios label. These first three are completely different from each other. Um, you can go to Wizard uh, Studios over at Fullman Streaming and check out the trailers right now. And what's unique about this whole deal is the filmmakers um, are going to go out and try to get friends and people who collaborated on the movies to uh, subscribe to Fullman Streaming. And if they get 50 subscribers, which is not a lot, but I think very doable, uh, then they're going to get a distribution deal here at Full Moon where we're going to release those same movies on DVD and VOD and pay-per-view and try to really get them out there. So it's a bit of a Kickstarter program. You guys can help if you look at a trailer for one of these movies and go, oh my God, that's really cool. You can also buy a subscription for a friend or inspire someone to subscribe. And as long as you do that on the page of that movie, there's a very simple button to push, uh, a vote appears. And if they get 50 votes or subscribers, um, you know, we're, we're in business and we're going to distribute their film, uh, their film in North America. So uh, that's really exciting because, you know, I travel a lot and I've been given so many movies over the last few years. And it's really hard today for these, these super talented filmmakers to find a home for these films just because the distribution landscape is so different. So we're opening those doors. And of course, Full Moon Streaming is going to keep doing what it does. I mean, it's going to have Full Moon movies and some Moonbeam films and uh, more stuff coming out of the vault and Grindhouse, we've got some acquisitions going where some really cool, unique Grindhouse movies are coming your way. But the fourth label is Wizard Studios, and it's the label for independent filmmakers. So that's number one, and super exciting to me because I'm, I'm sure it's gonna work out great for everyone involved. Uh, the next thing I just wanted to remind you guys about is Delirium Magazine, which has uh, got us all really excited. I mean, the timing's really sort of amazing considering Empire of the Bees, the big ass thick book that Dave J has been writing for 10 years, just came out in the UK. It was actually coming out in a few weeks. We got advanced copies. We put 100 of them up for sale and they're gone. So uh, that's cool. We probably won't have copies till later this year. But all this history about Empire and the early days of Full Moon, part of that's actually in delirium. So there's a super synergy going on there. And uh, as I read these articles that uh, the awesome editor Chris Alexander is conjuring up, um, it's just uh, kind of amazing stuff. A lot of it I forgot. A lot of it I think will be really interesting to you guys. How um, some of these franchises began, how my relationship over the years with uh, these awesome filmmakers dating back to the frickin' 70s uh, all started. So uh, Delirium, uh, we already have quite a few subscribers, so thank you everyone who's already subscribed. You can just go to deliriummagazine.com and you can also find it on Full Moon Streaming. Uh, and subscribe. You can buy one issue, you can subscribe for the year, but we are dedicated to making this magazine not only super amazing and awesome, but just chock full of things that people haven't really read about. And um, we have so many talented people involved. So, uh, and we'll be bringing them around to all the conventions we're going to be going to. So if you miss out on the subscription, just come visit us in one of those conventions and we'll have them with us. So that's Delirium. Now, I'm a little ahead of myself here, but I've been telling you guys about how we're going to reintroduce Head of the Family, Ganja version on Full Moon Streaming next month. So we're, we're having a blast putting that together. Mindy Robinson's coming back and doing all her fun stuff. The factoids are crazy. We're actually going back to the original 35 millimeter negative and making an HD master. We'll eventually release it on Blu-ray so it's gonna look super awesome. And we're creating some additional merch and I'm gonna show you right now something that anyone who's in the Head of the Family and anyone who is romantic at their core will be very happy about. And what that is, is these are the prototypes of these super awesome, amazing, <laughs> uh, hand-painted statues of the head of the family and the bride of the head of the family. I'm not sure what they're gonna retail for because we still have to get them made. They're tricky because they're really complex. And these aren't, you know, plastic. These are resin statues, all hand-painted. 
but they'll probably be here sometime eight, uh, late February or early March. And what's cool is, of course, you can buy them individually and they'll probably be a better price if you buy the set because in the true spirit of romance, you put these guys together and look, they're holding hands. It's unbelievable. I mean, how cool is that? So uh, this is coming pretty soon and this will be part of the head of the family ganja version, uh, which will premiere sometime mid to late February on uh, fullmoonstreaming.com. So that's one kind of cool thing. And uh, gosh, what else? I mean, there's so much, but there's a little promotion we're starting today because we're always trying to find clever ways to, in a way, remind you guys that we have created bizarre merch that sometimes with all the madness of life, maybe you, you know, you just didn't know or didn't want to buy or thought, well, that's kind of weird. But this promotion, which starts also today, is pretty awesome because it's about Blood of a Thousand Virgins, which is, I think, one of the better um, uh, grindhouse compilations. Uh, the amazing Nikki Lee is our host. There's clips from all these movies where all these poor virgins <laughs> get like they become unvirgins. And we thought we'd do a promotion where you can buy this DVD and a crack or for a special price. We haven't figured out the price yet. I think by the time you see this, um, it'll be up and posted on Full Moon Streaming. It's one of those 48 hour sales. But more or less, we're calling it a thousand virgins and a whore. That's it. That's it from the craziness to crazy merch. Uh, what can I say? This is a lot of fun. This is a big, a big turnaround year for Full Moon where we're reinventing ourselves because the old model's kind of gone. And um, I'm excited every week to come out here and talk to you guys and let you know what's going on. And I hope you're having fun because that's what we're doing this for. I mean, we're making organic movies. We're not CGI fans. We're trying to repurpose a lot of our stuff and get it to you in a very affordable way. I mean, you can't beat $6.99 for all the stuff we're putting on Full Moon Streaming. And there's a point, as I said earlier, later this year, that if we have enough subscribers, and you guys help spread the word, we're gonna be able to go back and make movies like Subspecies, which we're totally into doing. Uh, we do have a plan to make um, a new Puppet Master film, which takes it in a little bit of a different direction. We have a lot of plans, but <clears throat> the bummer is when you're in this business, even if you're careful, these plans cost dough. So we're just hoping that enough people join Full Moon Streaming, which is really supporting Full Moon, and we'll be able to make movies forever. So uh, thanks so much, and I'll see you next week. Ciao.